big game. You've got to bring your A game against this team. They've been playing a lot of tight hockey games. Let's bring it, fellas. There is your Zaxby's opening puck trap, and we are underway. Greg Cronin, the former head coach of Northeastern University, the alma mater of David Poyle. This one center. Good save by Soros, and the rebound blocked by Cody Glass and Dante Favro. Back to back, you'll get a shot block, but watch Soros connect the dots right in the middle. Find space, look at the eyes connected, and then Cody Glass helping out. Rebound loose in the slot, picked up by Colton Sissons, his first touch. O'Reilly, weighing the options. One-timer, Yossi White. Rebound off the backboard. Sissons had a look at it, couldn't play it. Now out of the box comes Strom. Strom one-on-one, he scores! Oh, terrible break for the Predators. Just as Strom came out of the box, they deal it to him, and he's able to beat Soros. A shocking turnaround. One play right here, missed shot, just goes by Sissons, and then just lifted in the air by Kalorn. Goes perfectly on the stick, a nice little move here. Quick hands, opens up Saros, look at it right there. He's trying to dig in and can't quite close up the pads quick enough as Strom delivers uh, an action. So the Predators, uh, now we're gonna have the gloves drop. Ross Johnston is gonna square off with Luke Shen. So Luke just talked to Kara Hammer and then he wants to change the tone. He said they're a half step off. He's trying to change it right now. Johnston's a big customer, tall order. Just wrestling around right now. Nobody really able to get free. Shen has a headlock on Johnston. So I'm not sure who initiated that fight. Yeah, and that's exactly what. And you could see this was decided before. They're going to go. And I wouldn't bet number two had something to do with why this happened. Getting that going. Get the boys going. Whatever it takes. A little flat. Not quite sharp enough. And, and Shen, one of the toughs. Look at the chin down, throwing lefts. Johnson is a tough customer as well, yeah. generating offense, good defense, those types of things have to be a little more consistent within the group. Forsberg lost the handle, picked up by Carrick, got a man wide open, save made by Soros, getting the pad down. There are ten shots on goal already, this is his ninth save, Leeson, wide open. Juice is an the mobile ID. A lot of good times going there. Here's a shot by Lacombe, action in front, tipped in. Vetrano got a stick on it, and it pinballed past Soros for a 2-0 lead. So the Ducks All-Star doubles the lead for Anaheim. Building right in front, and watch this deflection. He's battling in front there. You see him, he's ready for this tip, and just gets a piece of it for his 19th goal of the season. Oh, and then it goes off McDonough. It tips off of Vetrano, McDonough. Troy Terry from the circle. Draws Sissons over. Now they work it to the far side. McTavish. They bring it back to Terry. He looks back door. Got it to McTavish. And they score. What a shot. McTavish, a perfect short side upper corner. It's a power play goal for the Ducks. It's 3 0. There's 1 2. And this pass right across. And look at that shot. You can see there's not much room there at all. Saros is down, he's got the low part covered, and right there he tries to get his head over. Ducks with just 13 wins on the season, but as we told you, they're, they've been scrappy, they've been in so many games. This one off to the side of the net, in the slot, O'Reilly! Fought off there by Dostal. Fed O'Reilly coming back, and here's the battle one, right there. Guys just on the four check, cause a turnover, and then look at Tomasino, he sees O'Reilly there, just... Oh. Go out there and battle. It's, it's about the emotion at this point. If you have that, the rest will take care of themselves. Obviously, the details and everything. Just come out and battle. On the opening shift, it is who clears the zone. Let's see how Anaheim handles the lead. As you mentioned, Mace, they're not a good scoring team at all. Now here's the play right in front class. Stop point blank by Dostal. Wide here. But look, this is the hustle we're talking about. Look at Tomasino's effort. Good deception there by McDonald. Nashville had come out of the gates with a couple of good face-off wins. Trying to turn the tables on that one. Henry works his way down the boards at the half wall, centers it in front. Terry, right back door score. That might have gone off of Fabro. Two men down low with the numbers. Fabro sliding to try to take away the pass. But the Ducks have made it 4 0. It's like this. It, it's just, it's crazy. This is just a pass, kind of a, a blind pass across the net. Right here, trying to make the back door, and then Fabro with the stick. He's trying to break this. Terry's going to Strom. 
and then Fabro right in the middle, just right through the wickets. And, and when it, and it rains, it pours, you put a couple together here. Novak drops it off. Evangelista surveys, puts it towards the net, knocked down in front. It's loose. No stall. Swing it towards the net is Smith. He put it in the blue eyes. Ducks with an aggressive four check here. Nashville having trouble getting out. Ferrier to center ice. Tomasino drives it to the net. On his backhand. Save made. Rebound centered. Glass got a piece of it. Glove saved by Dostal. And McCarron got a shot as well. And then he's got support. He could see McCarron going to the net. Dostal and then Glass comes in. And then this one right here, he's just well, down. That's what they need more of tonight. Yeah, they do. And I think uh, the more that you simplify your game when you're having a tough time like there. Oh, there's another chance. And it's popped up in the air. It might have been going over the crossbar. Silverberg wanted to see what was coming in on the second wave. It's lifted out of there by Novak. Here comes Evangelista two on one. He's got Yossi with him. Evangelista, save made by Dostal. Off Evangelista right here. He's looking shot all the way. Dostal, good glove save, keeps it out. Win this final period. And he said, you know, just get positive things going. He said, when you look at it, it's an 82 game season. You have another game right around the corner. So you want to establish some positive things to close out these final 20 minutes. A no look pass, well anticipated by Lundestrup. That one got around Evangelista. Good keep in glass to Novak. No look pass, Evangelista. Backhander stop. Rebound, Tomasino looking for on the backside. Picked up by Glass. He tried to center it. Out of the box comes Gudis, and he takes it towards the net. Gudis all the way in. Saved by Soros. Soros comes out aggressively, and he banked it in. Gudis followed it up and knocked it off of Soros and into the net. And that's the kind of night it's been. The second time the Ducks have converted right after a power play expires. A player in this one right here. Saros comes out, makes a big save there, gives Gudis nothing to, to shoot at. And then look at this. Little bank off of his stick. I think it's Evangelista right here, off his stick, off Saros' skate, and in the net. He's working down low. He has his 19th goal of the year tonight. Fine stroll. He's got a goal tonight. One timer. Rebound loose. Saved by Saros. Scramble behind the net. Picked up by the Ducks. Over 30 seconds of possession time for the Ducks and a couple of good chances. Henrique. Strong backside. Oh, what a save by Soros. His best of the oh, night. Wow. Terry comes right down the slot. Off to the wing. A lunging save by Soros. Carrick lets it fly. That's blocked by a diving Carrier. Up the ice, Nyquist. Short-handed with Carrier. Carrier gets in. He scores! from this team and it, it, no matter what the situation is they compete and there's look at that block right there and Nyquist comes down he's waiting Carrier is the one who blocked the shot he gets up and continues down the ice picks this up and just slides at five hole Nashville on a scramble now need to get the puck back continuation Lacombe just over the boards drives in to get some tired players loose in front great save by Soros Inside the blue ice, Mitnikov, and then he drives into the next guy. They're going to let this play go. This is going to get some attention. Gurianov had a window, but he lifted the backhand way too high. McCarron powering his way down there. McCarron making things happen. Here's the shot they score. Tomasino delivers top shelf. A tremendous shift by Michael McCarron. This game. And right here, they keep pucks alive, and McCarron just battling. See, no stick there. And then McCarron just nice little fades out. Kind of a no-look little. Probably going to hit him right in the chest there, but he's able to see that one. Yossi once again. Evangelista a second time. This one into sticks. Lutz, Parson, and popped up in the air. Score! It's a 5-3 game. Nashville all over the place in front of the net, and it looks like it was Dennis Gurianov. A good sequence right here. Do what you can do, and look at McCarron. He's taking his eyes away. Look back there. Dostal doesn't find this puck, and now it's just a battle. Everyone just tapping that in, and Gurianov finally getting that to go. This will be a good look, and Dostal just trying to battle. Hits McCarron. Sissons looking for Forsberg. Got it wide, and that'll do it.
So Nashville ends up with 42 shots. A furious rally.